Good afternoon, I'm Maricel Halili. This is One News Now. Aside from the MRT-3, Lines 1 and 2 of the LRT as well as the PNR will also increase their passenger capacity to 30% starting Monday. The current passenger capacity of the Metro's railway lines amid the pandemic range from 13 to 18% only. Following the announcement, the LRT can accommodate 370 passengers per train set, while the PNR can load around 170 to 300 depending on the train model. The Transportation Department said they will gradually expand the capacity of the trains to up to 50% to help the economy. The Immigration Bureau will ease its departure restrictions starting October 21 in line with a new resolution issued by the IATF. Currently, only foreigners, OFWs, permanent visa holders, students abroad and those who had essential travel are allowed to leave the country. With the new ruling, Filipinos can now travel outside the country for non-essential reasons, but still subject to IATF protocols. Tourists are required to present a round-trip ticket, health and travel insurance, as well as a negative antigen test result taken 24 hours before departure. They also required to sign a declaration acknowledging the risk of traveling, which will be provided at airline check-in counters. And in world news, New Zealand reports a new COVID-19 case two weeks after the country announced that it had beaten the virus for the second time. Health officials said the latest infection involved a port worker who yielded a positive test result on Saturday. But because he was tested right after showing symptoms, they were able to immediately isolate his close contacts. The announcement came a day after Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern clinched a landslide re-election victory. Analysts said her ability to make her constituents safe amid the pandemic played a huge role in her win. Our favorite basketball league has returned. Catch the PBA Bubble Games live on TV5 every Wednesday, Friday and Sunday and on One Sports and PBA Rush daily. Games are also seen live via Facebook and YouTube live stream Radio Cinco and Signal Play. For more updates, visit News 5, the Philippine Star and Business World Online. Visit our website, onenews.ph for more in-depth analysis. You can also catch One News on the Signal Play app. Register for a free account now at www.signalplay.com and stream One News Live anytime, anywhere. I'm Arisil Halili. We are One News.